everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, we're going to take a look at just a beautiful 1970 uh, Ford F100 short box truck. Great truck, guys. Um, I was actually the third wheel on this. I had a buddy of mine actually uh, selling one of his vehicles. Uh, this gentleman had this truck, wanted to trade it in. Um, that's how I ended up with it. Um, but about five, six years ago, he said it went through a complete frame off restoration. And as it crawled under there, you can actually see there's polyurethane bushings. Um, did a nice job. Really nice truck. Uh, it's a, a, a truck's out of Oklahoma. Uh, it's got a real pretty paint scheme on it. It's a two tone silver metallic uh, with the black on the top. And really just a real good running, driving truck. Big block, uh, 460. Power steering, power disc brakes. You can see it's got uh, 20 inch US mags all the way around it. Good truck, good solid straight Oklahoma body. It's clean underneath. It's got a good, it's, uh, I, I really like the truck. I really dig it. I think it's got a good look to it. You don't see a lot of these Fords. Um, I haven't had very many of them at all. I like the way they did the uh, red uh, pinstripe to break up the, uh, the two-tone color combination. This looks like the original uh, trim here. In very nice shape. Bumpers have definitely been replaced. It, and now one thing I will tell you about this thing, it hits the road good. I mean, really runs and drives excellent. Slick paint on it. You can see my world headquarters uh, sign in the background. That's the best thing, guys. Glass is nice. It's got the uh, sliding rear window here in the back. Cargo light works. Uh, I like the way they've done it. They've uh, rhino lined the rear. This is actually my new Dodge. Got the exact same thing. Makes it very user friendly. Handles a little. It, the, the reason being, it comes actually comes out this way, so it's only on the one. It's only held down on the one side actually. So that looks a little weird in the photos, but just the way it is. Truck's nice and straight down the sides. Good looking set of US mags on it. Again, real clean underneath. Flowmaster dual exhaust, so it's got a real good sound to it. You see a little crack there in the paint. Like I say, really a good truck. Those are 20 inch US mags all the way around it. And there's a little stone peck right there. Again, does have front disc brakes. I saw a spot up here on the front where they've touched it up. Again, good running big block Ford, 460 cubic inch, Edelbrock four barrel. It's got a uh, Edelbrock Performer aluminum intake, all MSD ignitions, got an MSD box with a Pro Billet distributor, power steering, power front disc brakes, uh, C6 automatic trans. You can see it's detailed up real nice underneath the hood here. It's all painted real nice. They did a nice job building this truck. That's just a little dust there, guys. The guys in there are wiping it down here for me this morning. Missed some dust. Again, glass is nice. Paint slick. Uh, 
I like that red pinstripe. Mirrors are definitely, they're new. Door handles look new. There's your door tag. Interior is very nice, brand new carpet. Bench seat that's two tone, black and silver. Yeah, new carpet. I put the new Ford mats in it. Uh, really nice uh, billet and uh, carbon fiber steering wheel. It's got the factory dash. Um, Again, yeah, it's got the rear sliding uh, sli rear sliding glass. Um, 46, 531. I don't know if you can see that. I'm not real sure about the miles, guys. Could be 140, could be 46. But uh, like I say, it was frame off restored just five, six years ago. Factory gauges in there. He's also got uh, he's got an aftermarket tack and aftermarket gauges underneath there. Uh, original AM radio. Uh, again, Flowmaster dual exhaust. It's a nine inch Ford rear end with a 300 posi gear. So it's definitely something you can get in and cruise. Bed's real nice. This really is nice if you're gonna if you're gonna put anything in there. I'm gonna have to have these guys come shut that. I can't really do it with one hand. You have to shut that. You have to shut that. But no, I think he need to use that handle. Yep. There you go. Yep. Again, trucks clean as can be underneath. Again, when I crawled underneath it, there's some polyurethane bushings underneath there. Just a little dust there, guys. Again, seat's nice. It's been all repadded, refoamed. Gauges are nice and clean in there. Ready to fire it up. Dash pad's real nice. Good running 460 guys. This really runs and drives good. Good looking truck, man. works looks like they're using those gauges too except for there right yep oil pressure and temper down below Truck, man. Radio work. Yep. Radio does work. Lower motor work. Yep. Yep. Stock AM radio does work, guys. I uh, forgot to tell you, it's got an uh, electric fuel pump. Yeah, and make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram or our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking that little button there at the bottom. That way you can get a notification every time I post a new one of these videos.
that's just a good truck right there, man. 